Hello. In this demonstration, I'd like to show you how to deploy Manage IQ onto OpenShift through the Service Catalog. The Service Catalog is a new feature being developed on OpenShift that will make it easier to consume and manage services. The Service Catalog works with a collection of brokers, and the brokers handle the specific um, implementation details for the various applications. And the broker is what will inform the service catalog about these various applications that are available. In this case, we'll look at the Ansible service broker, which is powered by Ansible playbook bundles. And those are essentially a lightweight application definition that uses really just a bundle of Ansible playbooks to manage the tasks for uh, the various applications. So the application that we'd like to deploy today is Manage IQ. And before I do that, I'll just call out that since Manage IQ takes about maybe five to eight minutes to deploy, for purposes of this demo, I've already gone ahead and deployed one of them. And that's what you'll see here in this project, Manage IQ demo. So we'll go back to that later so I can show you this up and running. But for right now, we'll create a new project and we'll do a new deployment of Manage IQ. So I'll create a new project here called Manage IQ 2. I guess I should uh, fix that up. Okay, and now we will select Manage IQ from the catalog. And we'll see that we have a new web UI that comes up, tells us about the application, and then we have some options we could pick. This would be different plan offerings. Since this is still early work, we haven't implemented different plans for Manage IQ yet but this is where we would select that and then later we could change different configuration parameters. Uh, for this demonstration, we'll use the default parameters that are in the Ansible Playbook bundle. So now we'll pick which project we want to deploy Manage IQ to and we'll use the one I just created, Manage IQ 2. And then that's it. So right now that is getting kicked off. So what we will see is that an APB is running and that's the Ansible Playbook bundle. The Ansible service broker is executing that to do the actual deployment of Manage IQ. So we can take a look to see what's happening there. And we'll get a look at the logs. So I'll look at this guy that's running right now. And this corresponds to that APB. So that just finished, but if we take a look at it, we'll see what happened here is that this is Ansible that's running. So the Ansible service broker downloaded this small meta container which had the Ansible code to deploy Manage IQ. And then it kicked it off. So here we see things that are happening of creating a namespace if it didn't exist, um, modifying uh, a policy, creating a persistent volume claim, uh, creating services for the application pod, as well as memcached and Postgres setting up a route that we will access in a little bit, uh, deployment config, and so forth. So this is the typical code you might run with just simple OC create commands, and this is executed with Ansible. So if we go back to the web UI, we'll see in our project, now we have three pods that are running. And that happened from the Ansible code that got kicked off, and then we'll see that we have a new route up here. Now that route probably is not up yet because we haven't given it enough time. It'd still be several minutes before it's available. So just to make things a little bit quicker, I'm going to switch projects. And I'll go to the one that I did a little while ago. And now very similar, you can see there's three pods running, and then here's the route. And this should be up by now, so we can go take a look at it. Yep, and you can see that we have Manage IQ. Just log in, make sure it's working. Yep, and we are in there. So this is Manage IQ that was deployed through some Ansible commands through the service broker. Thank you for watching.